It's my birthday today. What? Cassie. Hungry, yeah. Look. Wow. We're gonna get some ice cream finally, some Italian ice cream, and let's have a look what Sophia is doing. She's over there, and she will be turning three, I believe, three times to get, I think, seven lucky years. Uh, so she's gonna turn around on a ball head, no ball. You know what? We'll see in a second. There's a massive hole in here. I'm sure you can see this from people doing it. Obviously, you need to turn one, two, three times. And then you should get, as I mentioned before, seven day, seven years lucky. Uh, we're gonna continue here through the streets, and uh, not far from um, actual cathedral. Uh, and we're gonna go to the best ice cream place, which is, as I said, just three minutes walk. And it's this one. It's called. I will show you. And uh, we're gonna get some ice cream and pancakes. Um, this is the one. A uh, very famous one and got amazing ice cream. If you've got kids, I'm sure you will appreciate it. And chocolate Italiani. That's the one. I'm sure I'm pronouncing this name wrong. <laughs> Let's have a look what we've got on offer. So we've got lots of coffees, fancy coffee. Look at that. Oh my god. So that's the prices. And we're gonna go inside. I will show you inside how. Um, how much they are and what they've got on offer. But that's how they're gonna look. Would you yeah. push, push, push. Mm, nice and cool. Okay, those are the combination of ice cream. So there's lots of different choices and that's how they're gonna come. You can obviously uh, order one of those um, or you can go for mix them uh, and match if you wanted to, but obviously those are different combinations there. So if you wanted that one, 
uh, or that one but we have end up to having a different one and we're just gonna sit outside because it's obviously that's nice that's how they look like they've got a little wafer with a hot chocolate white chocolate on top we massive um, to be honest, the ice cream were really, really nice. One of the best, I have to say, I have to confirm, one of the best ice cream we had in Italy. Uh, but this, this one, um, yeah, they we were incredible, as you can see from Sophia's face. She definitely enjoyed it. Uh, the only thing I have to say about it is obviously, uh, that's like a bit of a close up on the ice cream. Um, personally, I don't like warm ice cream to go with the cold one because they melt really quickly that's the only thing i will have to highlight in here that they melted quickly three of us had to eat it and still they were like dripping and so we had that ice cream and we ordered something else as well i will show you in a sec cassie loved ice cream too uh, as i said the only thing i didn't like about it was they were melting really quickly this is mine espresso how cool is that it's coming already with a wafer and a bit of chocolate really good quality coffee um, come on you have to have some espresso if you're in Italy right so this is a fancy espresso I would say of course we ordered another orange fresh orange juice we've been in Italy for a couple of days and every time we we're ordering fresh oranges and never disappointed us that how amazing uh, taste of fresh or freshly squeezed orange juice because it was so nice obviously this was what I mainly was ordering for kids and they loved it and then we had our fluffy pancakes. Oh my god, it was heaven. Just look at it. It just heaven. So yeah, that's Oh pancakes! Yeah. Pancakes. Right, we've got 20 minutes walk and I'm gonna walk to a special place. I have located an amazing place, little place with a pasta, freshly made pasta. And we only make them and open them like from 12 to 3 o'clock and that's it. So we're gonna quickly walk there. This is the um, obviously the scooters and some bikes. You can um, get a bike there and obviously bike if you want it. If you've got kids, you know, it's not that easy. But if you are a couple, I would recommend to get a bike, go for a ride. It's amazing, especially in the fresh air. And it's like so nice and the views and you can see more, obviously, if you've got a short time. We only had three days, I believe, one day in Milan. So uh, we went obviously to see the cathedral, but we are very sh short on time. So we're going to the place called a Pasta Fresca. It's amazing. Honestly, you can try some fresh pasta there, freshly made there every day. The same spinach but with meat, spinach and meat. If you want to work with pasta, holy burrata, so only with mozzarella, cheese. And this one is good, potato, uh, meat and goat cheese. Okay, so price-wise we paid only 8 euro for one pasta, which is amazing and you can get anything like it in whole Milan. It's incredible. Food is freshly made, freshly made pasta. If you love pasta, you have to go there. So we had a few choices. So basically you choose pasta and then you choose the sauce to go with it. We had this pasta and we chose pesto with it. This one was tomato sauce and this one we chose with burrata. So it's morala, mozzarella cheese. And there was some other choices as well. There's so many choices. Uh, you just, you know, we have to go for something, but we. We, we just wanted to try a bit of everything. Okay, it was really good. This one's really good. You like that one? Mm. Really strong cheese inside. Mm. Yum, 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 yum. You like it? Yeah. This one's Tomato one, I mean, I think the best one is tomato one. Okay, that was the end of our day trip in Milan. I'm gonna move on to Lake Como in the next video.